You may have seen a viral video recently claiming that Ibrahim I was obsessed with dwarves. Sultan Ibrahim I had a bizarre obsession with dwarves. He was so fascinated with them that he collected them and kept them as his personal slave. He was known to be mad and kept a harem of consorts as long as Shaq's arm. But is there any truth to the claim that he was dwarf obsessed? Let's find out. So I initially saw the video on TikTok, friends that know about my channel sent it to me and I wanted to do a full video on it, I thought it was really interesting. But the more I tried to research, the more likely it became that it was completely fictitious. It has 400,000 views on YouTube and I can't see anyone discussing that it's all probably a lie. Let's go over a couple of clips. He once ordered his dwarfs to dress up as soldiers and join him in battle. This proved to be a disastrous decision, as the dwarf soldiers were unable to fight effectively. I find this very unlikely, because the Ottoman Empire was only engaged in the Cretan War during the reign of Ibrahim I, with no records of he himself joining on the front lines. In fact, earlier in the war, an Ottoman commander left behind a really strong garrison and then returned to Constantinople for the winter. However, he actually fell foul off the Sultan and was executed. So this of course implies that the Sultan was in his court with his harem and not commanding a military unit of dwarves in battle. Unless there's an unrecorded war the Ottomans were taking part in, it's highly unlikely that this ever occurred. It's also recorded that Ibrahim was often distracted by recurring headaches and attacks of physical weakness, perhaps caused by the trauma of his early years. That doesn't sound like the kind of sultan that would take the battlefield himself. Weak in body and in mind, paranoid and decadent, he'd hardly make a military leader. The next claim I want to address is Ibrahim would also indulge in drunken orgies with the dwarves. So Sultan Ibrahim was renowned for his harem and his consorts are well recorded. Ibrahim had eight imperial consorts plus a long list of known and unknown minor concubines. His harem was huge and it had rules with women serving roles such as hostess. He did enjoy spending time with all sorts of women. For example, his seventh imperial consort was known as the fattest woman in the capital. There's no mention of dwarves, although there's potentially may have had a minor unrecorded dwarf concubine from time to time, there's nothing to suggest that he kept them around in cages to bring out for drunken orgies. The next claim I'd like to address. Ibrahim the Run would go to great lengths to acquire as many dwarfs as possible, often resorting to kidnapping them from their families. Again, there's no evidence that there was widespread dwarf napping within the Ottoman Empire. Dwarves may be found at court, but not in great number. In fact, the only recorded kidnapping for Ibrahim's harem was the daughter of a man known to the Sultan. He asked her father for her to join his harem, and when he rejected, uh, he had her kidnapped from the baths, but later sent her home, presumably when he grew tired of her. And the next claim I'd like to address if a dwarf displeased him, they'd be sewn into sacks and thrown into the sea. So this could potentially stem from uh, a story where a 330-pound Armenian woman named Sivakar Sultan quickly became the Sultan's new favourite, but she was also power drunk, and in a move that would eventually cost her her life, Sivakar Sultan lied to Sultan Ibrahim about a mysterious traitor who'd compromised one of his concubines, and in a fit of rage, the Sultan ordered his entire harem of 280 women to be tied in weighted sacks and tossed into the sea. As far as I'm aware, this didn't occur Kerr and he was actually deposed. And finally this clip. He would ride around on a giant tortoise pulled by a team of dwarf slaves. The Sultan did not, I repeat, did not have a giant tortoise that he would ride being pulled by dwarves. This simply didn't happen. If it did and you can provide proof, I will delete my channel. If I'm wrong about any of this, please refer me to a single source that mentions anything in the video in question. I couldn't find anything. If you did enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. If you are one of my subscribers, I know this isn't my usual content, but I was just quite keen to, to put this video out there.